Turpan City lies in the basin to the east of Tian Shan Mountains and to the north of Kumtan Desert. Half of this city is below sea level. Turpan has the world's second lowest place, Aiding Lake, the altitude of which is just higher than the Dead Sea. Turpan is also the hottest place in China. The flaming mountains, formed by red sandstone, are well known from the novel Journey to the West and have become a popular tourist attraction. With its hot, dry climate, Turpan has long been known for its grapes and is said to produce the sweetest grapes in China. During the grape harvest season, the Uyghur hold parties to celebrate the harvest. The folks perform cheerful Nazikum dances to Mukha melodies, and it is one of the happiest times of the year in Turpan. Xinjiang is a population of many people. 呃，许多古老的部族民族曾在这里迁徙居住、繁衍生息。Hoboksar, Mongol Autonomous County, is situated in the northern part of Jungar Basin, west of the Altai Mountains. The epic of Jungar, a traditional epic poem by the Orat people, originated here. Junai, 85 years old, is a respected bard and has lived in the steppe all his life. He says that bards chanting the epic of Jangar will lose their most important thing if they leave the steppe, just like eagles losing their wings. This step where the Oirat once lived, their descendants of the Torgat tribe heroically overcame many hardships as they moved westward and then back eastward to their homeland between 1628 and 1771. Nowadays, if you ask any Mongolian about Ubashi Khan, whether in the Jungar Basin or along the Boston Lake, they will answer with pride, Oh, he is our ancestor. For Kazakhs who have lived for centuries along the Altai Mountains and in the Ili River Valley, poems and horses are their most precious possession. In the Kazakh steppe, the bards who play Dombra and chant poems are honored as Akon. Each summer, there are many festivals in the Kazakh steppe, one of which is a performance by Akons who get together for singing and chanting. During the festival, anyone who passes the Kazakh steppe will be treated as an honored guest and fed a variety of ethnic foods, including mutton. 
There is a saying here that it is a great shame of you if you don't entertain guests at dinner time. The song, Why Are Flowers So Red, has attracted many visitors to the Pamir's Highland in the extreme west of China. Tashkurkan Tajik Autonomous County, or the Highland's Stonewall Castles, is a beautiful snowy paradise inhabited by the brave and kind Tajik people. Two years ago, we had the opportunity to attend a big wedding of a young couple in Tajik. The bridegroom, Jaman Iting, is a frontier soldier, and his bride, Ainisa, is a teacher in a primary school. Now that two years passed, we visit them again and are happy to see them living a very happy life and still in deep love. This 嗯，我这个公公也特别的慈善，我婆婆又特别能干，嗯，我的两个妹妹也特别好，相处的特别好。Tajiks oh, oh, worship the sun and the eagle. The dancers are just like real eagles when they dance the eagle dance in the sunshine to eagle flute melodies. When you travel in Xinjiang, you meet a wide variety of ethnic groups. Every day you see something new and surprising. The best houses in Xinjiang are the schools. And all the schools are taught in both Mandarin and the local language in all ethnic schools. Students learn Mandarin in order to better integrate into the big family of the Chinese nation, while mastering their native language helps them preserve their own culture. Because most ethnic groups here believe in Islam, Muslim restaurants are the most popular ones at dinner time. If you want to know more about Uyghur customs, you have to go to Kashgar. <laughs> The bazaar is alive with the culture of the western regions and exemplifies bustling and beautiful Kashgar. Here you will see pigeons fly over the ancient residential buildings, charcoal fires burn once again in Nang pits, and smoke rise from barbecue stoves. And you will hear the sound of drums and the voices of vendors. The busy Eastern Bazaar is a stage where various customs are performed. When you walk through these bazaars between the old alleys, it's like walking into the imaginary city in 1001 Nights. This is Kashgar, unique, wonderful, and hospitable.
If you are lucky enough to be in Kashgar when the Hari Raya festival is celebrated, you will witness thousands of devout Muslims gathering in Eidqah Mosque Square, the most solemn yearly event after which the whole city will be immersed in the ocean of joy. Dolan's songs are original and full of passion, like the broad and magnificent desert in Xinjiang. Their songs reflect the love and passion coming from their inner world and their dedication to this great land. Yeah! <laughs> 